morning. The 2022 avuncular road trip continues. Should have been 2020. There you go. Firstly, uh, it's raining. That's the first I've seen in a couple of weeks. Secondly, we're heading south. To begin with, I'm going to take a slightly different route down south from Kinlochu. I'm going to head towards Torridon and then back towards Kyle of Loch Elsh. And then from Kyle of Loch Elsh, instead of going via the Isle of Skye, I'll go going back over the mainland and heading back down south eventually to England. There's a few more things I want to see in Scotland first. I knew it wouldn't be long before I pulled over. Uh, I'm on a pass above Loch Torridon and there's some amazing cloud formations going on and I think it might be time for a pat uh, Now down in the valley there just wasn't enough water in those rivers and streams to make it interesting for me. However up here I seem to have no shortage of water. Yeah, well it's too windy to put the drone up here I think. Uh, a few years ago I did fly my drone from the other side of the loch. I'll put a little sequence up of that for you. Uh, the whole film is available on YouTube and I'll leave a link in the description below. What I've done is shoot a panorama right across the scene. Doesn't mean to say I'll use all of the images to make the final one. Now if it worked here it is. If it didn't work <laughs> you won't hear me say this. After that we'll pick up the story down at Loch Carron, which is away in the distance and to the left.
this is Loch Caron. Uh, as beautiful as the drive was from Torridon over to here, all you would have seen would have been the windscreen wipers, uh, so not good viewing. Uh, my stopping place for the night isn't that far away, uh, so what I'm probably going to do is find somewhere to park up on the way there, get togged up and go for a bit of a walk in the rain. Uh, I'll take a waterproof camera with me, uh, let's see what you can find. But first of all, uh, Loch Caron has something I haven't had for several days, and that's uh, internet signal. So I can download a few episodes of my favourite things, and uh, get a few supplies. I've never seen so many Porsches and Ferraris in my life. This route is part of the North Coast 500 of course. Now as I leave Loch Caron I'll be rejoining the route which I took northwards towards Kinloch Hu. Uh, so I won't be showing you that again. I'll catch up with you later on. Might be a spot of rain on the lens. Fantastic spot, both peaceful and very exposed, I think. Well, my campsite for the night is nestling at the bottom of the mountain, just down there. The 
today is most definitely not a loss. If the rain stays like this, I should be able to manage another walk a bit later on. I refuse to concede that the day is a loss. forgotten the stick which means you can forget your fancy camera angles jaunty walk pasts that kind of thing unless I can find a convenient tree to help me out The walk past was courtesy of a picnic table. This is Mulvich, and sadly it will be the last of the videos I post from Scotland on this avuncular road trip 2022. Should have been 2020. But it won't be the last video from this road trip collection. I'm going to head down south into England and I've got a couple of other locations in mind. I try to make my last day in a region as something a bit of research for future trips and Morvik certainly hasn't let me down. This is an area I'd really like to come back to. But for now I'm afraid I'm out of time in Scotland so I'm going to call this episode to a close and I'll leave you with some scenes and memories of today. As ever I have been your avuncular host. Thanks for watching. But I can't leave you without a poignant walk away. But as soon as I don't have my stick with me, how can I do that?